Hello, everyone. It's Matt Defeaty with Really the Executives, Elite Homes in Nutley, New Jersey. And the topic of this video is, is the housing market about to crash? Is the housing bubble about to pop? And the truth of, all, of it all right now is nobody knows for certain what's going to happen six to nine months down the road. Let's look at the things we do know. We do know that interest rates are rising. We do know that with certainty. We do know that home prices are still appreciating. We do know that buyer demand is still high. We do know that supply chain disruptions are causing issues with new building starts. This is what we do know. I'm here to try and take some of the uncertainty out of the housing market. Remember now, if you're purchasing for a need, it's a little different than when you're purchasing for a want. You want a larger home compared to you need a larger home, or you want a smaller home compared to you need a smaller home, whatever it may be. I always tell my clients, make sure you shop for a need. All right. Now, interest rates are around five and a quarter right now. Still not bad. Still not bad. Homes are still affordable. But as the interest rate creeps up, what's going to happen is the buyer pool is going to shrink. And when the buyer pool shrinks, it's going to quell some of the or quell some of the demand for homes. And then when that happens, Homes will sit on the market longer. Now, I don't think we're going to go into any negative territory uh, in the foreseeable future or for the rest of the year. I don't think you're going to see prices retreat. What I do think you're going to see is you're going to see appreciation slow. And then 2023 may be a different year. I don't think we're in an area where we're going to have a bubble pop or a market crash, we tend to be heading more towards a more even market. Now, we have a couple of things out there that can affect the market. We know inflation is affecting it. We know the interest rates affecting it. We know the war in Ukraine is not helping the situation, right? We know all these things. So, Buyers, if you're out there and you're thinking of buying and you're thinking, hey, you know what? I'm going to try and time the market and wait. You may be waiting a while. Sellers, you're still in a great position. But now what we're going to see, instead of 10 offers, 20 offers, you may see five offers, three offers. That's where we're headed right now. As interest rates go up, we lose buyers, but the demand is so high right now that we have a cushion there. We definitely have a cushion. If you're a seller and you're in that age range where you're thinking about retiring or maybe making a move out of state, out of New Jersey, then right now is probably going to be the best time to get the most for your home. That's where we are. Hopefully that will explain some of the things going on right now and help kind of, uh, you know, mask or, or, you know, get rid, of, get rid of some of the anxiety out there about buying and selling a home at the present moment. But that's what's happening. If you need any more information about that, you can reach out to me. I'm Matt Defeaty with Realty Executives Elite Homes, and this is Living in Nutley. Bye-bye.